Have you ever felt overwhelmed when planning out your D&D campaign? I don't blame you. Campaigns are often messy, sprawling things that can be honestly kind of tough to make sense of, but they don't have to be. In this lesson, we'll learn the first step to creating organized, coherent narratives by breaking campaigns down into their basic building blocks. Arcs, chapters, and scenes. Let's take a look. Let's start with the first question. What exactly is a campaign? Well, in my time as a dungeon master, I've run my fair share of homebrew campaigns, official campaigns, and, if I'm being honest, probably enough Curse of Strahd campaigns to last me a lifetime. But that raises the question, what sets each campaign apart? It's not the setting, or the story, or the villain, it's the characters. Put simply, a campaign is the entire tale of a particular group of player characters, from the moment they're first introduced to the last moment they appear. Think of it as the epic journey your players embark on, filled with challenges and triumphs and unforgettable moments. The Lord of the Rings is a single campaign. The original Star Wars trilogy is one as well. Can you think of any others? Right now, I'm running a campaign for a group of new players. So far, they've recovered a stolen emerald, located a lost heirloom, and even stopped a dragon tyrant's resurrection. These are all examples of arcs, specific adventures with distinct objectives. Campaigns are made up of arcs. They're the separate stories that form the backbone of your game. In a single arc, your players might travel through dangerous lands, forge alliances, and face numerous challenges along the way culminating, of course, in a climactic confrontation that shapes their destiny forever. If you think of your campaign as a series of books, you can even think of separate arcs as the individual books that make up that series. Let's zero back in on the first arc in my current campaign, the quest to recover the Stolen Emerald. This adventure saw my players venture through an array of colorful locations, from the sleepy town of Glenwater to the grimy sewers beneath it, and the peaceful forest where the thief had fled. Each one of these locations represented a single chapter in this arc, a particular place where the players faced adversity, gained new knowledge, and continued on in their adventure. Chapters provide a sense of progression, allowing your players to explore diverse settings and encounter unique challenges along the way. Now, the quest to recover the stolen emerald led my players into the sludge slick sewers beneath Glenwater, where they fought giant rats and spiders, negotiated with a mysterious aberration, and escaped a flooding stone cistern. Each of these scenes was, well, a scene. Just like in a book or a film, a scene is a segment of the adventure in which the players face a challenge, explore their environment, or interact with other characters. Just think of yourself as the director of a movie, but with a cast that's always going off script. Because here's the deal. As the dungeon master, you're a designer, not a dictator. You can try to influence and predict what your players might do and prepare accordingly, but at the end of the day, their characters, not you, are the ones who control how the story unfolds. Now, to bring things full circle, scenes aren't just the building blocks of D&D chapters, they're also the building blocks of a D&D session. Which means that they're the first thing that a new dungeon master really has to get comfortable with. In future lessons, we'll talk about the fundamentals of running a scene. Description, narration, pacing, adjudication, and a whole lot more. But don't forget the ingredients of a well-structured campaign, and how arcs, chapters, and scenes can come together to create engaging, memorable adventures for you and your players, keeping them hooked and coming back for more. Before we wrap up, I'd just like to invite you to join the Dungeon Mentor Patreon community, where you'll find a supportive network of other Dungeon Masters, a treasure trove of campaign building templates, and on-demand campaign advice to help you run and improve your game. The link is in the description below. Until next time, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in our next lesson.